A Kansas City, Kansas family is in mourning tonight for two lives lost to gunfire. Their 23 year old daughter and her unborn child. And they want to know why anyone would want to harm the young woman. KCTV 5's Kelly Taylor reports the crime has stunned the neighborhood. Kelly. A neighbor who lived in this neighborhood for decades says that they've never seen an incident like this and they hope that police catch who did it. Now, Saturday night around 11, the cul-de-sac on North 41st Terrace was turned upside down after a deadly shooting. Kansas City, Kansas police say Joycelyn Ibarra was found dead inside a car in a neighborhood near Parallel Parkway in 635. This was just two days before Ibarra's 25th birthday. Neighbors say they heard screaming, then gunshots, and the car rolled down the hill through the neighborhood and stopped between two houses. It was still running when three still running with three doors open when it was found. The young woman's family says Ibarra was 12 weeks pregnant and that comes as a surprise to people who live in this area. That's really a shocker. I really feel for that girl and her family. I'm so sorry like and wow. That's just something that you just don't know as a mother. It's you want to do everything that you can to protect your child. And police are still looking for Ibarra's killer. Tonight, her family is holding a visitation service and her funeral is tomorrow. Live in KCK, Kelly Taylor, KCTV 5 News.